Hello, my beautiful babes, and welcome back to the Bad Bitch Academy. It's your girl, Amber the Baddie, and I am here with another video and another baddie challenge. I know you guys have been sending me DMs like, bitch, where the fuck have you been? I miss your baddie challenges. As you can possibly see, I have moved. I am in fucking Hawaii now. I still... I just, I still can't believe it. It's crazy. I have a vlog coming soon with more behind the scenes, but for now, okay, staying focused. With this baddie challenge, it is all about creating your bad bitch schedule. Ladies and men, if there are men here, hi, thank you for being here. My lovely bad bitches, we have got to create our fucking schedules. We need to start showing up for ourselves. And that is why the week, the challenge for the week is all about creating your bad bitch routine, okay? Now, when you're creating your bad bitch routine, I really want you to think about what are those priorities and those real important things that you want to accomplish in your life? What are those things? Now, I actually made a whole video, you might have seen it already, um, about how to time block, how to create your bad bitch routine. I go really, really deep in depth in that video. I've got a, a free template that you can download that really helps you just map everything out. I'm going to link that video up above, so please go ahead and give that a watch because I don't want to like make the same video twice. Anyway, we're going to be creating our bad bitch routine. And I just wanted to speak about a couple of things specifically for this challenge. Now, this challenge is gonna go one of two ways, okay? Number one, if you are just new to your personal growth journey and god damn it's windy as fuck okay if you are kind of new and you're not working out you're not really showing up for yourself i personally think that doing the part one which is going to be a seven day challenge if you're new starting with just seven days is a really great place to start just to see how you like it and just to take it one week at a time I found for myself, especially when I'm starting something new, that if I say like, I'm gonna work out five times a week for three months, that feels very overwhelming to me and I don't actually end up doing it. So if you're new, where I want you to do the batting challenge for seven days, and if you're a little bit seasoned, and if you want to really challenge yourself, then we are gonna do the batting challenge for an entire month. Yes, you heard it, 30 whole days, one entire month of doing this challenge. And I'm gonna be doing a challenge for 30 days. I'm going to be vlogging my experience just to keep myself accountable, to be honest. Feeling a little bit nervous because I'm like, oh shit, we're about to get real here. But we're gonna do our bad bitch routine for a whole 30 days. Now, when it comes to creating your bad bitch routine, I just want you to think about what are those goals? And I think it's really easy to kind of break it up week by week. So let's say that, okay, I'm just gonna give some examples, right? Let's say that you wanna meditate, you wanna start meditating. Maybe you wanna say you wanna meditate every day, but oh my God, my eyelash is literally about to fly off. Lord have mercy. Okay, so let's say you wanna start meditating. Maybe instead of saying you're gonna meditate every single day, maybe try with twice a week. You're gonna do two guided meditations per week. You're not working out all the time. Maybe you wanna start, you know, I'm gonna do a workout video on YouTube, find one that's 15 or 20 minutes, and do that three times a week, right? You wanna start reading, maybe you wanna read one chapter per week, or 10 pages per day. Do you want to start listening to more podcasts? Are there certain creators that you wanna binge watch their content? Do you wanna do more affirmations? like? What are those things that you feel like, fuck, I really wish I could add more of that into my routine. And in the video that I posted that I talk about time blocking, I really emphasize that not all of us have the same schedules. I know my schedule is very open because I create my own schedule, but if you've got a job or if you've got two jobs or if you have kids, it might feel like you have a disadvantage and that you're like, wow, I am not, you know, able to spend two hours in the morning for a morning routine, then I really encourage you to break up your bad bitch schedule with morning, afternoon, and night, okay? So your morning, what is one or two things you can do in the morning that's gonna feel really good? Meditate, read, go for a walk, listen to a podcast, eat a healthy breakfast, whatever that is. Same thing, what is one thing you can do in the afternoon, even if it's for five minutes? 
even if for just two minutes in the afternoon you think about what you're grateful for or you try to eat a healthy lunch right what are some things that you could really start doing one thing one or two things in the morning afternoon and night another thing that i really encourage all of us to do but that especially for the babes who are wanting to eat healthier let's start meal prepping okay i am married to a fucking chef and i suck at this and we eat fucking pasta and lazy all the fucking time so i really want to get better at that so we are actually going to start planning our meals so sunday is really going to be like the day we plan our week sunday i'm going to plan you know okay these days i'm going to do my workouts these days i'm going to go do pole dancing here's the days that i'm working here's you know the youtube videos i want to create and the days that i want to edit them and really like creating my schedule and also like what am i going to eat what kind of food do i want to have what do i need to go shopping for what ingredients do we need to have like really making yourself prepared because if you want to fucking cook uh i don't know salmon but you don't have fucking salmon you're not gonna eat salmon like it's you gotta you gotta be prepared for this kind of shit so that is what we're doing for this next fatty challenge 30 days or seven days and if you do the seven days and you're like fuck that was great do another seven days we're trying to make this a habit it's not just do it once and forget about it but it's really about how can i make this a habit and what i like about doing it week at a time is that you can switch it up you don't have to stick to the same routine and i actually saw this post on social media the other day where it was like don't feel like you have to hit all five things in your morning routine or you didn't do your morning routine right because you can have all these different tools and modalities that you can just mix and match and twinkle in as you please there's no right or wrong way to do this as long as you are showing up for yourself so you see if there's anything else i want to add to this i think that's all so once again to recap the baddie challenge for the week slash month is doing your bad bitch routine i really encourage you to watch my video about time blocking like i said there's a template it's gonna make this whole challenge a fucking breeze for you if you're gonna do it for seven days actually stick to it okay stick to it hold yourself accountable go all in for yourself if you're doing it for 30 days also stick to it hold yourself accountable do the damn thing i believe in you i'm right there with you doing this challenge myself don't forget if you tag me on social media at it's amber the baddie xoxo tag me make a picture or a video of you doing your bad bitch routine and like i said tag me on social media one of you is going to win a free coaching session with me it's a fucking win, 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 baby. So what are we doing here? Tag me. Let's be friends on social media. Add me on Instagram. My account got deleted. So your girl is starting over. I have like 200 followers. So join my IG community. I, honest po I honestly post a lot on Instagram, way more than I do on YouTube or TikTok. Um, I love you so much. Okay. Good luck on these challenge, babes. I believe in you so much. If you are enjoying my videos, please hit that subscribe button. Send this video to a friend that you want to double up with and do the challenge with it's so much easier when you have an accountability buddy it's so much more fun when you have a partner so ask a friend encourage them to show up for themselves and for them to create their bad bitch routine as well we can all level up and grow together all right i'm done talking <laughs> i love you so much and i will see you in the next video